Hello, my name is Scott Anger, and welcome to your eighth or part two of your eighth on your 2.6 tutorial. Or, or, yeah, 2.6 tutorial. Well, in this tutorial, I'm, I'm basically going to show you guys what I wasn't able to show you in the, uh, the previous tutorial, and that was how to uh, basically save and blend all the files or all of the textures together so that it looks more natural like I already have done. I wasn't able to redo it because apparently my recorder doesn't do anything over one point or one gigabyte large. But okay, I'll show you guys very roughly and very quickly what you can do to make it work better. So let's just put some I increase the strength so I can see what I'm doing here. Okay. You can see that I'm doing some uh, let's do it like this. Right. So let's say we accidentally have it like all like this. And we want to fix that. So we're gonna choose our uh where did these textures go? Um I don't know where that texture went. But well, essentially, what you're gonna do is you're gonna mix in the the textures all together so that it looks more realistic. Like, uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna I'm gonna re-add the grass in here, the lighter grass. So I'm gonna open up not, uh, for a new one. And it's gonna be grass to enter and we're going to choose our image and we're going to go into textures grass and I can choose the one that I used before and there it is okay so I'm going to do okay this area look, right here looks like it's real okay hold on decrease the strength and all you have to do is do that and it's going to look even more realistic than it did before and you can just do that with the rest of your grass and stuff and other uh, things of the sort and it's just going to, the more you work on it the more it's going to, the better it's going to look so essentially and when you're doing mountain, it's not always all rock so you might want to just add a little bit of uh, green to it to make it look like there's actually stuff on the mountain like vegetation and such okay right there I need to fix that right there okay, so add a little bit of there cover up that a little bit in there too there okay so Essentially, that's what you are, are, all you need to know for this. And I hope you guys do learn something from me doing this. Um, let's finish this up right over here. Okay, it's looking good. Okay, so if I didn't teach you guys how to save in the previous thing, we already created our background, so all we have to do is click on image and save image and it will save that all so it's ready to go and you can exit into object mode and there's your lovely uh, world all you have to do is press home to center it on the center of your uh, thing and it's all looking good okay well, I hope you guys learned stuff from these things. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. Maybe we'll be doing some objects to put inside here. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. Uh, bye.